But you got the legend of summer threes. Ha <laughs> ha. The materials made to use that shoe is smashing any materials that I have ever seen on the Jordan. Period. So so the legend of summer threes, can you say how much how much you paid for them? No, nah, I can't, but they're not cheap. <laughs> So definitely the four digits. They're definitely not cheap. <laughs> I, I mean, how many pairs of those are there out there? Hey, man, let, let your money find out. I have no clue. I only care about having mines. Okay. Okay, because even, even the, real, the real serious dudes that I know really haven't been able to really give me much information. I think... Who else has them? Khaled has them. You have them. Who else? Uh, I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't hunt to see what niggas got the same shoe as me. I can care less because they ain't me. I only care about me. Nah, I feel you. I mean, they didn't buy. I mean, they didn't buy my shoe, so I don't care. I didn't buy their shoe. Like, you know, it doesn't matter. Like, I know I'm not the only person with it. You know, but how much? I want who they got it from, or why they got it. I'm not into all that. I only care that Trina James got it, and I'm happy. But I really want the twos, though. I want that's what I look because I'm, I'm a Jordan two fan, so that's what I'm looking for. I got five K for them too. All right, so you have you you got the Legend of Summer threes. Yes, sir. Do you think now that you know knowing having them in your hands, if you were to guess, do you think that they're gonna be hotter than than the the Red October Yeezys? What I'm going to tell you is this. What I'm going to tell you is I don't have the all red easies. I don't have that shoe. But what I'm going to tell you is that I don't compare Jordans to no other shoe. We don't, we don't, I don't do that. I grew up a Jordan fan. All I care about is Jordans. Easy shoes are cute, whatever. I got those too. But at the end of the day, it's all about how Nike and Jordan brand put the shoes out there. It's not about the quality or the look. It's about how they put it out there. Like the craze for the shoe, it's all left up to Nike and Jordan brand, how they release it, how many quantities they release. Trust me. It's not on. If they make, bruh, people got shot over the Bel Airs. It's not about the shoe, bruh. It's about how the business that they're doing. Have you heard a date on the on the Red Octobers? Man, I don't even care, man. It's not like I'm going to be in line. It's not like I'm going to be in line trying to be trying to go through all that craziness. I'm going to just wait and see if somebody got it for a decent price because I'm not going to spend 5K on those. Oh, okay. You won't? Nope. How, how much would you spend on those? I don't know, but not 5K. I want them for free. Maybe he saved up a little money and found a connect. He actually made up this whole story about he how he had a friend who had a store who had a connect. Mm -hmm. And I go upstairs and I'm like, hey, where am I at? And I look and I'm looking on the shelves and I don't see him. But I have so many sneakers. I'm thinking, oh, I must have put them somewhere else. Why do I feel rappers sneakers come and go? I think because they're fans of the consumer. You know, when your fans are the consumer, when your record is hot, they're gonna buy it. When your record is not hot, they're not gonna buy it.